Hi guys, okay, so I just made a 15 minute video and um, when it stopped recording, I looked at it and I'm like, why is it, you know, it does that, you know, the black box on each side, so it's harder to view, but I have, excuse me, I have um, my camera face you know, towards the side, so, I don't know, it was freaking out, so, here's another video, <laughs> let's try this again, um, oh, I keep looking at that, ladies, oh, it's shark week, I know that's a little too much information, I'm not gonna get into it, but this is what happens, I'm, and you're probably thinking, what, that's nothing, to me, oh, it's gone down quite a bit, this is what happens when I know it's like a foreshadowing. When I wake up in the morning and I see that, I'm like, oh, yep, it's Shark Week. It's coming. It came. Anyways, so I wanted to share with you guys a little something. Um, So the other day I was like, you know, when was the last time I put on my original pair of jeans, the size 28s that I used to fit in just right, like, and they were getting a little snug around the waist. I'm like, when was the last time I put them on? I couldn't remember. So I was like, let me just throw them on and see how they were. So I put them on, you know, and I'm like, whoo, if I move like, you know, take two steps, these babies are falling down, which I was like, yes, that's awesome. Um, so I wanted to experiment with something. I'm like, let me just try and see what it's like to do something like this. I'm about to show you guys. So yeah, um, what you're about to see is me in my pants. Um, you see this right here? No. Don't worry. Don't be alarmed. I do have two legs. They're just both in the same pant leg. I'm like, what? That's freaking amazing. I fit in half of my pants. Mind blown. I started on November 27th, 2017. It is April 6th. So I am like three weeks away from being five months keto. Okay. I fit in less than five months. I fit in half of these pants. Are you freaking kidding me? How awesome is that? And I cried about it in the first video. So don't worry. I'm not going to cry this time. <laughs> I am an emotional sap. I'll just let you guys know this. I've cried in a lot of my videos, but that's just me. Um, so yeah. Um, oh, hand in the face. I'm like an excellent camera woman. Um, <laughs> so yeah, here I am sitting in my recliner in half of my pants. So I am a solid now. I am a solid 22. Like 22s fit so comfortably. But I can get in a size 20 jean as well. They're a little snug. Yeah, whatever. But they're up and they're zipped and they're buttoned. So that's neat, right? Um... Oh, I am starting to feel better. Um, I think you guys can tell from my voice. I still have this cough that just won't go away because winter doesn't seem like it wants to go away in Wisconsin. So, oh, 
I just want it to be nice out. I want to bike like regularly. I want to get on my bike and be able to be in a t-shirt and, <coughs> excuse me, um, in my workout pants, which are baggy, so I'm going to have to get some new workout pants. Mm -hmm. Um... And I just want to bike, and I want to be comfortable, and I want to sweat. Like, I want to sweat some more pounds off. Um, I am currently, I started out in the very beginning at 388. Um, I am currently 310, so that is 78 pounds. Um, while I was sick, though, guys, oh... I was so sick, I literally could not keep anything down. I just, I couldn't eat. I had no appetite. I had no desire. All I wanted to do was just drink water. Um, I had a little bit of, I did have chicken noodle soup, but I didn't have the noodles. I fished out all the noodles and like 99% of the carrots, I took those out too. Um... So it was basically just chicken and broth and celery that I was eating. Um, so I had some of that. Um, and I was just, oh, I was losing way too much weight too fast because I wasn't eating. And <coughs> I wasn't drinking as much as I should have because all I wanted to do was sleep. I just, I felt so awful that all I wanted to do was sleep. So that's all I did. And I weighed myself um, last Sunday, right? Oh, I think it was last Sunday. Um, and I was 316. And... Four days ago within a week within a week I was down to 304 and I'm like okay that's freaking amazing I like to see that I am so close to being under 300 pounds but I clearly wasn't healthy because I wasn't eating because I wasn't hungry and I was barely drinking because all I was doing was sleeping and I knew that once I got my appetite back, that it would climb back up. And it did. And now I'm 310, but I'm also, it's Shark Week, ladies. So I'm always up in water weight. Um, once it's gone, I'll be back down to normal and everything will be great. Um, I try not to weigh myself during Shark Week, though. So I did this morning, and I was just, I was feeling, I knew it was going to happen. So I was like, okay, I'll just weigh myself right now, and then I'm not going to weigh myself until another week, because then I'll be back down to normal. Um, so, yes, I will touch base with you guys again in a week for my weigh-in, but I promise I will make more videos. I know I've been slacking so much. I just, I'm sorry I've been so sick, but I'm feeling better. And, <coughs> excuse me, um, it may not sound like I'm completely all there, but I'm, I'm like 90, I would say 90 to 95% better than I was. Um, so yeah, I wanted to share with you guys my little, not really little, it's pretty big, non-scale victory. I mean, seriously, I'm just sitting here in my recliner in half my pants right now talking to you guys. <sighs> I feel like a mermaid. It's so cute. Um, it's just, it's awesome. I just, I can't believe that. I don't... I start my, um, I have my first therapy appointment on the 20th of April. Because 
I need to learn how to cope and deal with all these changes. Yeah, they're great. What I'm doing is amazing. Um, but mentally, it's starting to catch up to me and I'm, I'm not knowing how to process this all. So I need to talk with somebody. And I think it will help me too once I reach my ultimate goal weight to hopefully um, be able to just mentally maintain all of this. Because once I hit my goal weight, I'm not going to go back to how I ate before. But I'm not going to necessarily continue strict keto. Like, um, right now I'm supposed to be eating up to 50 carbs a day. Um, my doctor said that my, um, carbs because my vitamin deficiency is because I went like so drastic and I wasn't taking vitamins and I, I just wasn't completely 100% taking care of myself even though I started eating properly. So he felt as though as I should, um, up my carbs a little bit, which I do. Um, I will eat like half a banana every other day. Or I'll just get in some more veggies and stuff like that to get my carbs up. Um, I, I don't want to do it like, you know, with garbage. Just because it fits into my macros, I'm going to do it. I just, I don't want to do that. That is a slippery slope. Not going to happen. Um, but I think that that you know, once I hit my goal weight, I think that limiting myself to like, you know, keeping myself at like even 50 carbs a day will allow me to maintain my weight loss. Um, because I'll definitely be a lot smaller than I already am. And I'll be more active. And I think 50 carbs a day and an active life is okay. Um, but that's in the future. You know, that'll come with time. I just, I need to focus on now and, you know, healing and getting 100% better. Um, and I just wanted to pop on here and make a video and just let you guys know how I'm doing. Um, so I appreciate you guys so much. Thank you guys so much for watching and subscribing and liking and all your wonderful warm comments. It literally melts my heart to see all like the love and support that I have from you guys. So thank you. Thank you so much. And please just continue watching because I'm a little crazy sometimes, you know, sometimes I cry for about a half an hour. <coughs> you know, I'm just, that's just me. I'm an emotional sap. This is a whole huge hormonal, like physical, like roller coaster that I'm on that I'm starting to like, you know, get into the groove and this is my lifestyle now and and I'm okay with it because I'm getting smaller, I'm getting healthier, I'm getting that summer body girls. It may, be, it may not be this summer, you know, but by next summer, ooh, I'm going to be foxy. So... <laughs> Thank you guys so much for watching. Have an amazing weekend, and I will talk to you guys soon. Thank you, thank you so much. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. You guys are all amazing. Thank you. Bye.